Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to stop applications from opening or running at startup on your Windows 11 computer. So if you have different applications and it might be slowing down your startup, if you want to disable some of them that are usually unnecessary in most cases, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to turn off as many or as few as you choose. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So we are going to start off by opening up the search menu. Type in settings, best match, or come back with settings. Go ahead and open that up. Select the apps selection on the left side. And then on the right side, you want to go and select startup. So at this point, you should see a list of your startup applications. And you may see something that looks very similar to this if you went into MS configuration. Or, you know, in Windows 10 or Windows 11, it's in the Task Manager under the Startup tab. And you should be able to see a list of all the various startup applications on your computer, as well as the impact that's having on your system boot time. So if you want to turn any of them on or off, you're usually more than welcome to. Generally, antivirus software, you usually keep that on if it's even a choice. Um, I don't usually turn that off. Printer software, usually I turn off everything. Some things like if you're using OneDrive or if you're using Dropbox, for example, I would keep them on despite the heavier boot resource requirement. But generally speaking, I usually turn everything off for the most part, like I said. And it does improve the startup speed of your computer and you know you're not actually disabling the programs by turning it off here it just doesn't need to start up immediately when your computer boots up so pretty straightforward process guys on how to access these settings and as always thank you for watching this brief tutorial i do hope i was able to help you out and i do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial goodbye